Hey there, today I'm going to show you how to draw Superman. So let's get started. We'll go up to the eyes and we'll draw in his eyebrows. So we'll start with one side. We'll draw an angle up on one side like this. And we'll do a downward curve that goes up into the middle of the eye, just like that. Okay? I'm going to thicken the eyebrow up just a little bit on the top side there. Okay? And then below that is his eye. So I'm going to draw a straight line that goes across into the eyebrow. Okay? And on the edge, I'll draw another angle down that mirrors that eyebrow line. And then a little black dot inside for his eye, for his pupil. All right? Let's move over to the side. And we're going to draw the wrinkle in his nose. Okay? So a little curve. And then we're going to do sort of a curved nose that kind of almost comes straight down, but just a slightly in an angle. And then we'll draw a tip that comes back in. Okay? And with a little nostril, we're just going to do a little hook on one side. All right? Now for the other eyebrow, I'm going to do sort of what I did here. I'm going to curve up, and I'm going to come down just a little bit. And I'll thicken that eyebrow just a little bit on the top side. And like I did on this side here, I'm going to draw a line across, just below the eyebrow, and a slight angled line on the end. And then I will draw in his pupil, just a small black dot. All right? So there's his eyes. And for his mouth, just below his nose here, I'm just going to draw an upward curve, just like that. And then on the side here, I'm just going to come down at an angle. All right? At the front of the mouth, I'm going to do a little slight curve in. Okay? And then I'll connect these with a sort of a straight line across. And then for his bottom lip, I'll draw a line just below that mouth and curl up the tips just like that. All right? Let's go up to the forehead. So here, he's got a sort of a sloped forehead into the eyebrow. I'll come in towards the eye. And then I'll come back out for his high cheekbones. And I'll curve downward towards his chin. Right? Then from here, I'm going to go straight across the bottom, right? And in the middle here, I'm just going to put a little bit of a, a dimple, okay? And I'm going to come straight up at an angle towards his jaw. I'll come straight up the side towards his ear. And so for his ear, I'm going to come up and out, go straight up, and I'll curl down slightly, okay? And then for the inside of his ear, I'm just going to do a little bit of a hook and then an opposite hook just inside to finish that off. Okay? And for the side of his hair, I'm going to come in towards the middle of the head, just like in the same angle of that eyebrow. I'm going to curl back out slightly. Okay? Now here, I'm going to come around and towards the middle of the head. I'll hook back out and in the opposite direction, I'll hook in, just so this is the curl in the front of his hair, okay? I'll hook that back in towards that middle, and I'll curl around, and I'll just finish that off out towards the forehead, all right? Let's go to the back here again. So above, above the ear, I'm going to come straight up, all right? I'll do a curved angle slightly, okay? Now this is where I'm going to curve the front of the hair, so I'm going to come up at the highest peak in the middle of his head, and come around and slightly poke it out beyond the forehead and curl that back in. All right, let's get into the body. So if I imagine this hairline coming down behind that ear, I'm going to take this line and curve it out. Okay, so that's the back of his neck. And for the front of his neck, I'm just going to go inside slightly from the chin and come straight down with a small line. Okay, and we'll do a little bit of detail here for the neck, a little bit of a curve there. Okay. And then from here, just below that neck, I'm going to draw a straight line, slightly curved upwards, okay? So from here, I'm going to come around just like that, all right? He's drawn his cape, so from this point, I'm going to come straight out, okay? Straight out. I'm going to curve down, I'm going to do an overlap for his cape, okay? And I'm going to come down an angle for as it goes over his shoulder. And then from here, I'm gonna leave a little bit of a gap and I'm gonna curve that line and connect it right to this point here, okay? Let's go to this side here. So at that chin, I'm gonna curve down slightly, okay? And then I'm gonna draw a line from this point, just slightly above that shoulder, down into this area here. 
come up on this side, come straight down, okay? I'm going to do one little curl, okay? This is where the overlap is. Come up and slope you down towards the shoulder, and then I'll connect that line just like that, all right? Now let's get to the arm. So I'm going to do crossed arms here. So on this side here, right where that point is, I'm going to draw a shoulder. Okay. Now I'm going to go back and forth just so I know I've got the right distances and I'll eventually meet up the arms here. So I'll do the same thing here, shoulder. And from here, I'm going to come out. Okay. And then down towards the elbow, just like that. Sort of a straight line there. Okay. And from here, I'm going to come out and then curve down to the elbow. Okay, so here's the elbows, making sure that they're at the same level here. Okay, so then now I know that this forearm is gonna come up here and meet up with the biceps. So I'll do a curved line, so like, I'll go down and back up again, okay? And then from this point, I'm gonna draw the bicep going into that shoulder there, okay? And then from here, I'm gonna draw a curve out, and then come down, okay? And then I'll come down slightly, and I'll draw the bicep coming up, almost touching that shoulder line there. And then from here, I'm gonna draw a curve and connect that elbow just like that. All right, let's draw his insignia on his, on his chest. So from the bicep, I'm gonna come up at an angle on both sides, just like that. And I'll curve a line to sort of mirror that line up at the top. Okay, and you'll see a little bit of his S. So I'm going to go in and, you know, the S has like a little bit of a frame around it, so come up on that corner, go across, and curl that down, okay? On this side, pretty much the same thing. Come down, cross, curl down, then I'm going to come up a little bit, and then I'll connect that corner, okay? Then from here, I'm just going to draw the upper part of the S, and inside here, I'm just going to color that in black, All right? Just like so, okay? And then just to finish this off, let's go into the cape. So I'm just going to do a curl cape down. From this arm, I'll just come, come down here and then draw the hips. So from just inside this elbow, and then draw a curve like that. And then from this side, I'll curve in and then out for his thighs. And let's draw his belt. We'll draw one curve, and two curves, okay? So equal distance apart. Draw two hash lines down here, two lines here, and then a circle in the middle, in between the two lines, right? And then let's draw in his Underwear, blue or red underwear, and we'll curl those two lines up just like that. And there we have it. There's Superman. Thanks for watching.